Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Hello guys, welcome to my channel You are watching me from Sunrise 252 Please if you are new to my channel, subscribe for more videos And turn on the notification in order to be notified whenever we upload a video In this video, I want to show you how to do square root program using JavaScript and HTML Okay, let us start our video I will directly go to my text editor Or my editor which is a sublime text here is my editor. I opened a new page. Therefore, I will save the file. So I will just save it in the desktop. Then you have to give a name to your file, which is square. There is another one which exists before. So I need to change the name to square only. Square dot with HTML extension or HTM only. Okay, here you go. You can start writing your code with HTML tag. Here I have to define the title, which is square and bottom. Square root program. Using HTML plus JavaScript. Therefore, there are two sections. First, I have to design my UI or user interface using the HTML and second, I will go for the script or the JavaScript program. So, I have to design my UI. I have to start with input text. I have to give ID so that it can be recognized. Here, I have to create the button. Then, I will use the button tag. Inside the button, I have to give, I have to give the event which is on click, on click, then I will give the value. Simple as that. Then here I will give the input. ID answer. Then I will directly save control s or you can save by clicking file and then save right click open in browser here you can see i have designed my ui or user interface this is this is the value you have to enter the value right here and also if you click here the square of this number should come here so this is what i'm going to do then the ui is complete then i have to go to the script i will open i will simply open script tag then function function i will take this event on click value which is square root you open a press and then you will define var which is a variable num which is the variable name of the variable then i will write document document that get element by id get element by id by id Here I will define the number. This is the number and it is the ID of that input. Then I will add dot value. We are taking the value from the user. This is the input value. Then when the user enters the value, then we have to take that, we have to capture that value and we will wait for the next step. Next is var result var is a variable result is a variable name result is equals to num times num because the square root of a number is that number times the same number then next is document dot get element by id 
answer that value is equals to result okay let's see if this works control save save the file go to the browser and refresh give the value like five for example we give five then you click on square pattern then it will automatically give you the square root of that number refresh control r and we will try for another number six square is that six is the simplest way that you can do square root of a number by using javascript and html you can try as much as you can and then it will work fine okay we can add some css we can change the look and feel of the page we can add some css like background color we can change the background color you can simply type style tag then background background color background background color like sky blue you save the file and you refresh the page then it will automatically change from white to sky blue so you can add as much as you want but we'll just stop the video here so this will be the end of the video thanks for watching please if you have any problems while you are practicing on your own computer you can ask do not hesitate to ask i am here to help you so you can ask as much as you want and uh, i will be there helping you thanks for watching the video please if you think this video is recommended for you give like and also share with your friends tell a friend to tell a friend you can write your comment in the comment section below thanks for giving us your time to watch us do not forget to subscribe the channel if you didn't subscribe yet so that you will be getting our videos anytime we upload but the only way you can get our video anytime we upload is to turn on the notification please don't forget to turn on the notification so that you can be easily notified whenever we upload a video thanks for watching see you next video